Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're doing well. And in this video, I want to show you how you can um, generate a child theme for your main theme. So um, in the last video, I showed you how to install um, the Astra, Astra theme and I showed you how to install the demo content. And now in this video, I want to show you how you can um, easily uh, set up a child theme for your um, main theme. So if I go to uh, where is it appearance and then themes there I can see all my themes and right now we have um, the Astra theme activated and also we have some um, WordPress themes. I will quickly delete them so that they don't uh, in the way. So of course, so now we have um, only the Astra installed. I will enable the auto update. And why we need an, a child theme? So we need a, chi a child theme um, for our theme. If we make um, customizations of our theme, so if we um, yeah play around in the um, customizer of our our theme, so. Um, here is the front end and here you can see the custom the customizer and when I active activate the customizer and we make some changes here for example the colors the um, fonts and um, something like this or even if we make some additional CSS changes so if we change the CSS code or add some CSS code here then um, yeah it's really important that we have a child theme activate activated because now um, the automatic um, update is activated and every time every time um, we get an update of our theme then everything gets uh, overwritten so all our customization is gone and we have to do it again and um, in order to prevent this, that um, due to the update, all our customizations and CSS codes are uh, getting wiped out, we need a child theme. So a child theme is um, where we store all the customization data and this is not affected by any update. And this is, uh, yeah, pretty easy to, to do. Let me show this real quick because, yeah, um, um, now we have some some plugins that um, help us with this um, and previously we have to code it ourselves and or yeah go into the ftp or do it with an ftp and um, now it's it's pretty simple so let me show this real quick so um, i will go to to plugins and add new plugin and for this we will use a plugin and then i go to the go to the plugin search bar here and, and search for child theme Oh, <laughs> child theme. Okay, and we use yeah we <laughs> we use the first uh, the first one child theme configurator by Lilea Media. So I think um, this is the best, and you can see um, they have over three hundred thousand active installations. Um, yeah, they have a good good rating, and we use this. Then I click on install. And it's really simple. So, and I click on activate. And now you can see the um, plugin is installed and activated. Let me go back to the dashboard. And now we can go to appearance. Uh, no, where is it? No, where is it? Uh, tools. Yeah, to, under tools. Um, if we go to tools and then child themes. And here you can see um, our our current theme that we have installed. We have installed Astra, and then we can click on Analyze. Now, um, yeah, it's pretty fast. Now they um, analyze our our uh, theme. If the theme is ready for um, a child theme, and everything looks good, the style CSS is present, perfect. And then, um, yeah, you don't have to change anything here. Uh, please leave it on um, primary styles the primary style sheet so um, and this you can also leave uh, everything is good so and then we can click on create a new child theme and i think yeah it is um, already yeah it's already done because the website is not that big so this is why it is uh, so fast so um let me see if this okay yeah uh child theme is generated now we can go back to appearance themes and now we have a copy here you can see uh, um, now we have uh, astra child and when we go to activate then our child theme is activated and then we can leave this 
and refresh the site and yeah now you can see the, the site looks the same um, yeah but the main benefit is that if we make some changes in the customizer or we um, add some custom CSS code then after um, when there's an update of the main theme then um, yeah this prevents from wiping out all our customization and all our code yeah, and uh, that's it pretty much. <laughs> so if you, if you have any questions, then um, yeah, put it in the comments down below. I try to answer all your questions as fast as I can and read it as fast as I can. And um, yeah, if you like uh, my content, then um, please give the video a thumbs up. And also I would appreciate if you subscribe to my YouTube channel because I will publish uh, more and more helpful content about um, yeah, WordPress, web design, SEO, WooCommerce and all the good stuff. So then, yeah, if you, like I said, if you have any questions, put it in the comments down below. And um, yeah, for this, thank you very much for your time. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video. Bye.